Hello and welcome to this week's 20 time vlog with Brian Solomon and Julia Solomon. Today we asked some seniors a couple of questions such as, do you plan on going to college? I do. No. Yes, I do. Yes. No, not really. Yes. Yeah. In 2015, the percentage of students enrolling in college immediately following high school completion was 69.2%. This year, about 3.6 million students are expected to graduate from high school. And in the fall of 2017, some 20.4 million students are expected to attend American colleges and universities. Now next, we asked, what college are you planning to attend? Uh, UC Santa Barbara, are you of our? I hope to go to UC Berkeley. Brigham Young University. Crafted. Uh, University of San Diego. Next, we ask our classmates if their college choice is socially driven. Uh, no, I wouldn't really say that. Yes. Uh, no. Uh, no. Yeah, it was. Uh, I visited the campus. Uh, the culture. I would like, yes, yeah, so it is socially driven. And the next question we asked was Are you the first in your family to attend college? Yeah, I'll be the, the first one. No. No. Yep. No, both of my parents went to college. 34% of undergraduates were the first in their families to go to college in the 2011 academic year, according to the NCS. And now on to our final question, which is what are you planning to major in? Why like uh, forensics? Um, law. Just criminal law, family law. Either biology or geology. Physical therapy. Business administration. Of course you don't have to go to college, but your options in life are much more limited if you don't. Statistically speaking, college graduates earn far more than high school graduates and have more satisfying careers. And the reality is, many high school students feel that they have to make a decision for their entire life now, but that's not really the truth. Nothing that you decide today can't be changed tomorrow. If you make a mistake, you can always start over and try something else. So don't worry so much about the whole college thing. As you go through high school, it will sort itself out. But only if you're open to all the possibilities that you could choose, including going to college. Well, that's going to wrap up this week's vlog with the class of 2018. We'll see you next week.